I have a really cool transition in mind. The only thing is, is well, there's two things. The makeup's already done, and I haven't do I haven't done them before. I ha I have not, because I just thought of it. And also, I already filmed this look with another transition. So, but it's okay because I literally only have one video with this eye makeup, right? So I should make another one, right? Right? I need to know how people like just get the silhouette of their body and everything else is red. Do you do you know what I'm saying? Okay, everyone's saying to go on Snapchat and type in this filter for a silhouette. Oh, I typed that in wrong. Okay, we're gonna, I guess, go with this one. I don't know, we'll figure it out. We're gonna take off this makeup, but first we need to take off the rings because I don't know how y'all girlies be putting on skincare, taking off your makeup with your, all your jewelry on, it messes me up. I even take off my, my engagement ring, which she's so cute, but I do take her off because I literally can't deal with the way it feels. So I guess this is also going to be a take off my makeup with me, behind the scenes transition tutorial. I didn't want to take off the eye makeup, it's so pretty. Now that I filmed all the transitions, when we put it into CapCut, I'm actually using the one with the red filter as an overlay and to fade into the red filter instead of it being a transition. Hitting splice and the rhombus and slowly, gradually turning it darker and darker. And then I'll just make sure everything looks clean and smooth and stay tuned for the results. 